Hi guys, uh, for any of you that are having the same issue as me with the origin, uh, basically the issue I was having is this icon would disappear and give me all kinds of issues. Uh, basically the reason the icon disappeared from here, this happened when I went to play Battlefield 3 one day because there was an origin update, there's a new version. I'm going to give you the link to the new version in the description, it's the entire new version, not that little thing they give you I'll show you what they give you this it's it's not that that's not what I'm gonna give you guys it's there will be no update once you're done it'll just be done uh, basically what you guys what was happening to me is when I noticed this I, I went into origin and sure enough this was disappearing right here the origin exe file was completely disappearing on me so what I did was I uninstalled it, reinstalled it with the uh, one I just showed you guys, this one right here. That would not work uh, at all. Each time I in installed it, the origin exe would disappear. So I remember what I did last time I had this issue and I went into the forums and I searched for the new version of uh, the whole version. Uh, just show you guys what I mean. Uh, oh, oh, I need to go like this. History downloads. Yeah, this right here. That is the entire version. You see how this is 42 megabytes, and this one is only 11. This is the entire version that's everything that's in your origin folder. So basically what I did is I opened this up, I clicked extract to, if you don't have this, it's WinRAR. You can get a free copy. Uh, you just basically need to go to, you create a new file on your desktop, a new folder, new folder, there we go. Okay, you don't really need to worry about naming it because you don't need to leave it there very long. And then you close that and you click extract again and then you see a new folder here. You click OK. And then you double click on it. And now what, you, what I want you to do is copy everything in this folder. And then you go to computer program files if you have the 86 version go to it because that's your 32 bit and then you go down to origin where is it and then you paste everything in here I've already done that so I'm not going to do it uh, and that should solve all your problems but try to make sure you do this uh, I went advanced click run as administrator and then it'll always run it as administrator for you and you shouldn't have an issue at least not until the next update anyway uh, if you do go to control panel go to users accounts and make sure if you yours doesn't look like this switch from small or large icons to category then account users pause this for a sec sorry about that uh, click on user accounts make sure you're doing this for the user that you're using your origin in because I only have one user so that's going to be a bit different if you have two users make sure you click on the one you're using this one with your origin account on uh, then what you need to do is click on change user account control settings and yours will probably be right here drag it down click OK it will ask you to restart your computer do it when you restart your computer if this still doesn't work copy and paste everything back in there and you should be okay if this works for you guys thumbs up if you can uh, comment 
would be awesome if uh, especially if this doesn't work for you and you find something else that does post it in the comments uh, so other people can find it and if it does work for you you find something in the comments that does work for you please thumb thumbs up the uh, comment so everybody else can see it at the top in the top comments uh, like I said hopefully this help you helps you guys <laughs> excuse me and if or if or when I run into further problems with origins on the next update I will post my solution on here for you guys uh, good luck I hope this helped out uh, if you want to help me out sub subscribe you know where the button is uh, I'll be posting more videos like I said about any issues with origin I have uh, game installations uh, going to be doing a video tutorial on my FX6100 the overclocking of it that will be my next video unless I run into any more problems in between then and now but uh, that's it for right now uh, good luck guys have a good one bye